Why is Chick-fil-A so freaking crowded all the time? I don't understand. I mean, yeah, it's a good chicken sandwich, but geez, every time you come here, it's like this. I just want one um, honey pepper pimento uh, sandwich and just a cup of water. Okay, you got any sauce today? Uh, no. I said my name was Eric. Does, does anybody ever use a fake name when they ask for your name at these places? Sometimes Caleb and I use like some crazy names just to be fun. I'm thinking I should uh, do this mustache. What do you guys think? One of these cool uh, hats with the mustache? I think I could pull it off. Okay, I am in the car. I just got my chicken sandwich. I am recording this after the fact because when I went to upload this video, I realized the sound quality was so horrible because I think the microphone on my phone was right next to the air conditioning and it was like 90 degrees outside, so I had the air blasting and it just sounds terrible. So right now I am getting into the uh, chicken sandwich, honey, pepper, pimento, whatever it's called, chicken sandwich. And the thing costs $7.73 with just the sandwich and a water. I didn't get any fries, I didn't get the meal, nothing. So right now I'm taking my first look and I'm saying how disgusting it looks. Like, the thing was dripping, it was soggy, like the whole bottom of the cardboard container was just soaked. The, my bun was soaked. I don't know what they did. Look at this, it's dripping. It was just so gross. I'm going to say an unpopular opinion right now. I think the waffle fries at Chick-fil-A are pretty disgusting. Now, I, I like the waffle shape, but the fries just do nothing for me at Chick-fil-A. I don't know if they just don't have enough salt or they taste too potato-y. I don't know. But I'm now discussing the fact that I'm not even sure if I like pimento at all. I'm not sure why I'm even eating the sandwich. The only reason I am is because I kept seeing it online. Look how gross this is. Look at this. This was what came to me in that box and I'm trying to adjust the camera it looks even worse this video is just a complete disaster kind of like this sandwich but I'm saying the only reason I'm eating this is I kept seeing people post about it and and advertising so I guess they did their job with advertising because they got me to buy it so congratulations Chick-fil-A now I'm taking my first bite It was not bad. I don't think I got too much of the pimento cheese. I left that in there. Do you see how terrible the sound was? I said that it wasn't too bad, but I didn't really get enough of the cheese. I was just basically getting the chicken sandwich. The thing is just sopping wet. I'm glad I had like eight napkins with me. They could have put 30 napkins in that bag and it still wouldn't have been enough. But I'm continuing to eat this sandwich to see if I like it or not. It's amazing. <laughs> it's really good. Um, it's got, I didn't realize it had jalapenos in it. I didn't even see those. Okay, I don't know if you heard that or not with my terrible sound, but I said it was absolutely amazing. I didn't even realize there were jalapenos on it. Uh, I don't think it needed the jalapenos. You can just take them off, but the actual sandwich was really, really good. I would definitely get it again. The only problem is it's just hard to eat because the thing is swimming in juice. And it's amazing I didn't get my shirt just covered in this cheese substance, honey or whatever was on this thing. Like, look at this. It's like ridiculous to eat. But it was really, really good. It was a taste explosion. I am so glad I tried the sandwich. Was it worth seven seventy three? dollars eh, Probably not. But whatever this honey, cheese, pimento, pepper concoction they put on this chicken sandwich, it was really good. Um, really good. And I'm just glad I went and got it. So with that being said, if you are around a Chick-fil-A and it's not Sunday, I highly recommend you at least give this a whirl. Let me know if you had the 
ridiculous like dripping sandwich or did I just get a, da- a bad one? Maybe it just got too hot or something. I don't know. Or maybe it'd be better if I got it in the store. Now I'm choking to death. But with that being said, may the adventure continue. Go eat some chicken and have a great day. And just remember, if you're recording in a car with air conditioning, don't put your phone right next to the vents. Yeah. Sometimes I like to vent, but I don't like to hear it. See you next time.